and away we go. Haha. <laughs> Alright, let's go back to... Oh, where am I? On the Tish 3. Fully upgraded, hooray! I need... Let's see, 2600, I need another couple of tests, so let's... Uh, hop over here. In this wonderful monoplane. With lots of 762s. And let's see how I do. <laughs> Mr. Saunders, hello, greetings. Of course, ordinarily in the motor pool, I talk history about various aircraft or various tanks and vehicles. I don't know a hell of a lot about early interwar World War II aircraft, so the history side of things is not going to happen very much here. Instead, what you're going to get is the entertainment value of watching somebody who's not very good at warplanes try to get better. They have indeed, Mr. Austin. Ukraine, Eastern Front, early evening. Of course, it is the Eastern Front to Ukraine, and we're going to see well, you know, interwar American biplanes. Forward airstrip, is that what we're going for? Pilots, get ready for action. Let's go. Oh, God. Attention, you are entering the zone controlled by the enemy. I am? Oh, horrors. Okay, I guess we're going left. They must be our targets. Alright, let's see what we got here. Okay, that got locked. Fantastic. Now what? Going in the middle? I guess we're going in the middle. And I have no altitude. Okay, we go up over the hill. Do I have a hill gunner? Yes, I do. They may have had the right idea, actually, by going with the going with the middle first, securing that, and that way they can go north at their own leisure. Okay, so what can I kill to gain control of the garrison back? Because it seems to be rather, rather thoroughly wrecked. I appear to have some significant problems here. Okay, so apparently the keyboard will allow me to... It's like tier three I'm on. I guess part of my problem was that I was backwards on uh, I was trying to steer right and I was pressing left because of course I'm facing to the rear.
130 knots. Still down to only two two bombs. So how do I how do I re uh, how do I get more bombs? Do I have to fly over my own base? Okay, well they have that base, so maybe I can uh, do something about this one. Okay, they have repaired it. So now all I have to do is drop some bombs on things. Or not. Okay, let's go down this way. Maybe I can... I don't know if I can sneak past them or not. Let's see what happens. Nope, that is not what you call sneaking past. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Way too many red guys. I keep aiming for me. I keep seeing that bright yellow circle and thinking that's my crosshair. Got nailed by a bow fighter, I think. Oops, back to battle. Okay, we wait. I mean, you really are something of a sitting duck in a heavy aircraft, aren't you? the blues going down there. Still down to two bombs. Receiving reports about rapidly deteriorating weather conditions. Support will be unable to reach you. Do you read me? Over. There are just too many reds on top of that base. Let's go to the airfield maybe. Obviously, I'm not going to survive in that fighter environment. Step it up! We're losing the battle! No kidding. That's oh, you don't have to There's press... No You don't have to press fire. It figures it out itself. That's one way to get rid of me, I guess. I have absolutely no idea if I was doing any damage to him whatsoever. You've done what you could. Go back to base. That was fairly pointless. <laughs> uh, let's go back to the fighter line, I guess. Fight them with my main guns. Yeah, you're probably right with a uh, against a heavy fighter like that. I, I'm presuming that the Blenheim is a heavy fighter. I really have absolutely no idea. All right, let's uh, hop over to the American side. It's a it's a Hawk. I'm, I'm on somewhere. Yes, the Tier Three Hawk. And I need. Uh, 
lots more XP. <laughs> attack aircraft. I was doing kind of okay with the tier 2 ground attack aircraft because it's so bloody slow there was no way that anybody can stay behind me to shoot me. So we wait. At least I'm wearing the right shirt for the job. Uh, no equipment? Yeah, it's tier 3, I don't see the point really. Uh, maybe when I get to tier 4 and I'm actually staying in that, uh, staying in the tier for a while. I suspect it's gonna, oh, no, I was expecting to go up against a bunch of bots. Okay. Forward air strips. We are still in the Ukraine, the Eastern Front, early evening. So hang on a second, is that a railway bridge? No, it can't be. That's a lot of money that they spent to build a bridge across that. Well, they could have just gone down here, crossed over and looped around, I mean, really. Wait. I presume it's one of the Curtis designs. I mean, I don't know very much about it. It must be said. So I continue to load. Does seem to have rather... Uh, Locked, doesn't it? Oh, that sounded like uh, that sounded like a crash. <laughs> well, that's reassuring. Let's load back in. Let's try to load back in. Hello, computer. Wake the F up, computer! Well, I am contributing muchly to this fight. I'm probably flying on autopilot right through the middle of the battlefield right now. That trailer was one of the best things we ever did. I'm simply providing a, an XP pinata for folks right now. You are approaching the area of combat operations. Am I ready? Oh look, Be I just ready. got shot down by something. Alright, let's go this way. Oh, 190, I'm much faster now. I contributed something useful! That air defense fighter. Oh, and I'm stalling. Right in the middle of the AA blanket as well, which is pretty uh, unfortunate. Um, not good. I 
think those are known as negative G's. Aircraft. I was doing like 80 knots and stalling, so it was an easy, easy target for that. It almost looks Italian. I don't know what that is. Some pretty big guns. Okay, let's try this again. We're going left, it seems, are we? Okay. Somebody shot at me already. Quite a trail of things here. I have no idea what the Flying Warrior badge is. Aha! We have an airfield. Yay! Us! Go us! Go team. Another AI aircraft, I guess. Receiving reports about rapidly deteriorating weather conditions. Support will be unable to reach you. Do you read me? Over. It's another AI aircraft. I think. With an in like Frank. Whoopsie. Okay. Where are the non-AI things? It's got to be the last one, surely. There's a heavy storm here. Unable him. to there proceed. Return into base. Do you copy? Never mind, it's gone now. They've almost got us. There. There he is. Fortunately, we have a lot more ammo in this game than the real aircraft did.
they fly even worse than I do. Probably saying something. Alright, so hopefully we've had enough of that. We have complete control of the skies. Hooray! I think. Is that it? Do we win? Why am I smoking so much? Somebody had a bad day there. Victory Yay, we won, We're I think. I can shoot better, yeah, probably. Back to hangar. Okay, so we got a win on that. Hooray! With any luck, I might even have unlocked the next tier of aircraft. We will see. Welcome to the world of warplanes. Good luck, good hunting. Yeah, okay. So that's it. But half of them were... Tier go official. Yeah, about half of them were bots, it looks like. Alright, let's hop back over to Tier 3. Let's see how I'm doing on my research. Aircraft experience, 3,000. Uh, upgrades are... Let's see, to the fish 2 is 3,900, so I do need to go one more go. And I'm still waiting to find out how the devil to reload. Um, reload ammo. Or go. Whoops. I'm just trying to get to the IL-2. I used to enjoy playing IL-2 Sturmovic many, many moons ago. I think anybody who's interested in airplane war games probably did. As far as, I think, Forgotten Battles, I think, was the last expansion I got. I didn't go as far as the 1946. I do remember enjoying IL-2 air races, where you'd, uh, because of the way the skins were basically PSD files. Uh, you could create whatever skins you wanted, so I had my uh, IL-2 air racing skin was um, uh, tailcoat EINTM, which are my initials, and uh, sort of a, a variation of the Belgian Alpha Jet uh, tricolor scheme, with sort of a sunburst uh, with green, white, and orange. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of fun. It's the next patch, I have no idea. Well, if if they resupply, do you have to be on top of your garrison or your airbase to resupply? Because they don't, they don't seem to be coming back for me. Maybe I just don't last long enough to allow for them. Attention! You are entering the combat zone. Get ready for battle. Good luck. Ah, we must be in Egypt. You are approaching the front line. Yes. Off we go. Aha. Charge. As I say. Of course, without a bomb site, this is uh, amusing. I am under AA fire. Yes, I am. Tail is damaged. Yeah. Okay. Fortunately, we got the uh, we got that. So now where are we going? We're going north? No, south. I think. Or are we just milling around? I think we're going south. Wait, just a uh, there's a wrench icon on that. Is it possible that if we capture it, we repair? My elevators are not looking happy. There's an air defense 
aircraft there. You see, my one bomb has... My bombs have not returned yet. I guess they all got there before me. Uh, so, how do I repair? Do I have to fly over any particular part of the airfield? Do I have to pretend to land? There we go. I guess you can only repair so much in a period of time. Oh. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Aha! We're back in business. Of course, this will probably be over by the time I get there at my wonderful speed of 128 knots. You know, I'm gonna ditch a bomb and just see how long it takes to reload. I have machine guns. at me. I'll have you know. Oh, let's go over the top here, and away we go. What do you mean I like destroyed? It was red. Is that that little white timer at the bottom? Possibly. It appears to be. I appear to have my bombs back. damaged again. I have no engine. Help, I'm going down. No engine. No, nope, I have an engine. <laughs> I'm, I'm at full upward trim at this point. Okay, so. Whoops, sorry. There's nothing for it. Let's see if I can get back to my repair. Too many red guys. Enemy on my tail. No kidding. Somebody got it from me, so... Somebody's up there, but I don't know who it is. I can't see him. again, I guess. So it looks like this only happens once you have completely expended all of your, uh, all of your gear. Oop. 
Ooh, his. Now they got the end. Uh, that part. Okay. We are back in business. My bombs aren't, but. Oh, hell, I've got 10 762s, caliber 30s, or whatever. We cannot support you any longer. The I am now on my own. Heavy. Yay. Do you oh, copy? Over. Let's see how we do. Whoops. Fighter there, unfortunately, is going to come after me in a moment. No, or not. Oh, hang on. if those are anywhere near where they're supposed to be going. Oh, there's a concrete building. That's probably not too much. Right. And it's flak gun versus... Aircraft, I guess, Steve. Oh no, it's the bloody Blenheims again. There seem to be a lot of them going around. Is it? I don't know. I actually haven't figured out how these bars move yet. Oh well, back to uh, back to the hangar, and let's see how we're doing on that hawk. Probably should actually read the instructions. <coughs> or something like that. Alright. Hawk. Hawk 75. Okay, here we go. Uh, experience. Yes, I can upgrade. P36. Research. Haha. -ha. Elite status acquired. Alright, let's. My free XP, and uh, I guess I gotta purchase the thing. Hmm. Well, that's annoying. I have insufficient golden credits. Okay, let's not get a crew. Let's see if I can convert my pilot from the er, uh, the earlier Hawk. Yes. Okay, hangar. That's so. That is him. Information? No. I want to send my crew back. There he is. Can I adapt to send him via the barracks first? Yeah, I do. Alright, let's try this pilot. Maybe. Pilot for the Hawk. Is 
the Hawk 75M. That is him. He was a 75%. Oh uh, well. I thought it was a 94. So 94% pilot Edgar Overman. Cannot find Edgar Overman on here. There he is. Tech Sergeant Overman. Yeah, that must be him. Alright. And now can I train him? Retrain for P36. Yes. And he's back down to 50 percent. This is going to take me a while. Oh well. Away we go. Sell off the old ship. Oh, that's a good idea. Although in fairness, the uh, I don't think they got me a hell of a lot of credits for it. Okay, let's see how we do. <laughs> Ooh, my new B1 video went out today. I need to set that live. Okay, so again, I'm told that if I shoot down AI airplanes, it helps control the airbase, so... Cover your allies! Hit the enemy! And we shall win! Airbase is first. Which one? Oh yeah, battle. Okay, we are still in Egypt, and I'm in a slightly more rugged aircraft, but then again, I'm sure so is everybody else. What do we got? We got tier fives, four, everybody's a five and a four. <laughs> You are so approaching hardly the above front everybody line. else, am I? Off we go. Okay, I need to find somebody who looks like he knows what he's doing so I can stick with him. for this airbase. Pretty, uh, pretty impressive roll rate. I'm not sure that's really all that useful, that, uh, that view, but okay. Aha, I see a wrench on it. That might be worth it. Wait, we're going... Crap, we're going this way. I don't see a wrench on this one, unfortunately. Oh, yes, there is. fighter. Finally got the uh, thing to overheat a bit. Shot down by a rear gun. Bloody Blenheims. <laughs> Is 
Not a Lewis gun? Really? The embarrassment I got shot down by a Lewis gun? Alright, let's see what we're fighting over. I guess we're in the middle. Tier 5, that much I remember. And there's a whole bunch of red guys coming at me. Alright, uh... Can't remember if that was an Immelman or a Spit S. I think it was an Immelman. When you roll first, then Looper. Thomas. I'm going to assume it's safer to go after this guy from beneath. Red guy. There he is. Another tank to him. I have no tactics to this whatsoever. I'm just going wherever I see the red things and I'm hoping for the best. Where these guys are by way of attitude. Oh, excuse me. Seems to be a little tricky. Okay, now what? 
Now we go this way. Heavy fighter, light fighter, bow fighter. Watch out for the bow fighters. So are we ganging up on one? Or are we ganging up on this one? Whoever's doing that shooting is a hell of a lot better than I am. That wasn't me. I don't know what that was, but it wasn't me. Okay, in the meantime, somebody is blowing up our own base over here. Excuse me, sorry. And I've lost him. He's faster than me, too. Could. Go back to base. Okay, we lost somehow. However, that worked. <laughs> if you can't kill the players, I don't. Well, if I can find the players, I would have. My problem is I can't seem to find the buggers. All right, let's try a, uh, a higher. T I need I need credits, so let's go for a higher tier premium and let's see how I do. Uh, I did absolutely miserably in the XP fifty, so let's try uh, let's try Corsair. A shiny airplane. Go to a tier seven. I'm a tier seven premium. Tier 5, Tier 6, Tier 7, bizarre Japanese thing, Tier 7, oh I got a Gloucester Meat here, huh. Okay, well that's, I get extra skills, okay, so I can either get Detective, or Fire Duration and Damage, or Extinguish it Fire by Active Maneuvery. Well, uh, reduces damage by 20%, I'll take that. <laughs> Alright, let's give it a go. So I probably need to buy some upgrades for that as well, but... Alright, there's no siren on a Stuka. <laughs> Big holes in a dive flaps. No, I don't think that was it. I think it was the Jericho siren was a. It was mounted under the port wing, if I recall correctly. Shouldn't be too hard for me to check up. I seem to recall it looked a little bit like an air horn and was mounted under the port wing. Yeah, it is. So the Jericho Siren is this thing in the middle here. Let's turn it on on the way down. Doesn't look like an air horn though. I got that one wrong. <laughs> Yeah, the, the dive, the pretty much all dive breaks have holes in them. Look at an American dive bomber, you'll see that there's holes in those as well. Not sure I understand the purpose of it, why not just use a smaller break if you want less effect, but I'm, uh, I'm no aeronauticist. Show me what you can do, okay, so I have an entirely different map, with no terrain. Looks like a nice little island in the South Pacific. I was very disappointed, I have to say, when I went to Tahiti. Um, all the... No, wait, we're going right. All the beaches were rocky. Ok, 
Okay, well, that's a boomerang. Australian aircraft. Said for all those caliber 50s. Oh, hang on, I see some red guys. be able to help my guy out here or not. I tell you, he's trying. That was actually a human kill. I feel much better now. <laughs> uh, am I supposed to be shooting at parts of this base? All Enemy oh wait, no, we just got it. Them. Where? These things? Okay, so which way are they coming from? Well, I see everybody's coming this way, so... Wait. I'm at a an eighty degree bank and I'm not turning. Huh. Well this must be the fighters in question. Hell did I lose them? I'm trying to get underneath them. Okay, there we go. Let's go back down again. I guess they have tail gunners. Hooray! That said, I think we got a little bit distracted from our other job here. Finding red guys to shoot. There are some red guys around here somewhere. I saw them. Oh, there's one. Whoops! Oh, that was a... Uh, that was a whoops. My bad. And that's why I don't use these... How? I'm open to suggestions. Now that I was looking at it, I don't think he had uh, he had a target. I think it was just an AI thing that was uh, part of the scenery. Okay. Get rid of the respawn. A lot of people like the respawn. Alright, let's try this again. What 
take a hand shield. Okay, I guess we'll try to help this guy out over here. Defeat possible. They've almost got us. Liked it. You know, instead of just arrows, I was wondering if there's a way of saying, hey, these guys are uh, fighters, these guys are heavy aircraft, something like that. So it looks like it's a uh, one of our attack aircraft. Look at that, it's a ship. Hang in there. You'll soon be cut off from support. I say again, support will not be yeah. available. Turn back. The enemy forces. Well, I guess too we got strong. cut off from support. ganged up on after you kill the side. Alright, back to hangar. That wasn't uh, that wasn't very successful. Alright, we got one more and I'll try Well, I need to do the grinding, so back to the P thirty six here. Give my uh, start working some experience for my crewman. Yeah, this will be the last one. I'm only supposed to stream for an hour. I'm gonna go back to uh, get back to my other job, writing history articles and whatnot. Area of combat operations. Be ready. Alright, a mining plant. Engage in low and mid altitude maneuvering combat. I need a HOTAS setup. Well, what I am using is this. Okay, I see a big glowing thing in the middle. So I guess we shoot this. I suspect the opposition is heading that way too. Oh, he got there pretty quick. I don't know if he's achieving anything. Guys, I see more red guys. I see flat going straight up. Looking for attack aircraft to kill. There's one. Absolutely no idea what kind of aircraft that was. Slow though, isn't he? Let's go right past him again. Yeah. F-110. Well, at least it's got big guns, so I can expect that. Ok, 
Okay, I see glowing things. I'm not sure what that means. Did I actually upgrade my... Uh, I may not have upgraded my guns, now that I think about it. Let me take a look Be at that. Okay, so we're apparently most of the way to... Captured. Crix the He-Gun. Is a heavy aircraft of some sort? Locked for 30 seconds, wonderful. Okay, time to get out of here, I think. My wing is damaged. Is that a B110 again? No, it's an I-16. Is that a pop-off, I think it's called? I was talking with, um... One of the staff here, and I you know, just wanted to have my, how my streaming is going. So, well, I kind of suck at warplanes. I said, well, how's it going? So, I'm sucking. Well, you get better. And here, try this, try this. And, uh, so generally, I just plain suck. <laughs> so, yeah, I've got one caliber 50 and one 762. That might explain why I am not doing so <laughs> amazingly well in this aircraft. We did put a caliber 50 and a 7.62 side by side. All positions the fight are captured seems to be over by here. the enemy. You must turn the tide of the battle. I'm on my own. I don't want to be on my own. Bad things happen when I'm on my own. Ah! He's trying to avoid him. Curse you, 110! You've done what you could. Go back to base. Ha <laughs> ha! Useless game. <laughs> I did not do well at all. I have to uh, one day do a f uh, the McDonald Doghouse F1 Barker, Snoopy's weapon. All right, so let's see. Here I am in my P36. I did not mount the better engine. I did not mount. Whatever this fuselage upgrade is. Ah, look, let's try this. Let's try adding an additional four thirty calibers. No, wrong button. Damn it. I might do much better with more guns. That's a bizarre thought. Mount additional 40 cal. Ah, 430 cows. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. And we will also not mount the caliber 50 because I don't have enough credits. So let's exchange. I don't know. I need 2,000. 10. Okay, so I now have two caliber 50s and two and four caliber 30s instead of 
one and one. So I should actually be <laughs> vaguely dangerous at this tier. That is a significant uh that is a significant weapons upgrade. But uh that's the end of the we'll have to come back to this in two weeks. Uh tomorrow is a twelve o'clock um uh, far enough lead near people duck here. Yeah. To the airplanes. Try to go after fighters, then hit the GA. Yeah. Well, the problem is with respawns. By the time you knock down the fighters, you knock down all the fighters, and they've respawned and they're coming back at you again. So you're at it forever. Um, all right. So tomorrow is uh, I'm back to tanks now for the rest of the week. I'm here Thursday as well, and then I am off. I'm going to Nashville, Tennessee, for a weekend away with the wife. Then it's down to Sydney for the Sydney server launch event. At which point I whisk my way back and it's off to Corpus Christi, Texas for the Let's Battle Tour for the USS Lexington, or the former USS Lexington. Uh, you, have to, you have to be careful. It's not like the USS Lexington Museum, but it's just former uh, carrier Lexington. Um, and then I'm back again the following week. So that's my schedule. Um, I'll see you on the morrow on the Tanks channel. Have fun!